Athletes from 39 different states came to Capitol Hill today to make a push for more federal funding to serve people with intellectual disabilities. They all participate in the Special Olympics. Kevin Lewis now live at the Hill with a look at what those athletes are doing right now. Hey, Kevin. Hey there, Leon. Yeah, after spending the entire day talking with U.S. Senators and Representatives, members of the Special Olympics, they have come here to the Dirksen Federal Building, and they are now tapping into their Italian side, playing a light-hearted game of bocce. You can see the action here. Uh, in all seriousness, though, today's annual event, it's really important to the Special Olympics. It reminds elected leaders, while federal funding is absolutely necessary for this program to survive and thrive. You know, worldwide, this organization, it sponsors 4.4 million athletes in 170 countries. One of the main missions is for people with and without intellectual disabilities to play unified. And that is exactly what is taking place right here in front of us now. Hey, in case you didn't know, Los Angeles is going to play host to the Special Olympics World Games this July and August. 7,000 athletes spending nine days competing in 25 different sporting events like swimming, soccer, and gymnastics. But the focus tonight, it's just about having Having fun and again the goal here Leon is for a world where people with and without intellectual disabilities playing unified that is the message message they want to get across tonight but for now we are live on Capitol Hill I'm Kevin Lewis ABC 7 News all right thank you Kevin and that's a great message because ABC and ESPN folks are very proud to be the official broadcast partner of the unified relay across America that's right and they're getting started with a little bocce yeah, I love that a lot of fun sad they're indoors too I know <laughs>